Hey, Precalc. So this week I have a, um, an assessment for you that I'd like you to do towards the end of the week. And looking at the stuff from this week, um, you basically have two sheets that have some sort of practice, show you the types of questions I'm gonna ask, as well as how to answer them. And now what I wanna do is show um, some ways to, how to take the test essentially. So in Teams, eventually this will pop up for you. It'll, it'll pop up on Wednesday. This assessment will be open Wednesday morning at nine and it's open through Sunday uh, night at midnight. And what I want you to do is somewhere in that window, take it in one setting. Um, don't close it down and then come back to it. I have it set so you can only go to it once. So sit down, do it in one setting. You can use a calculator, you can use Desmos. Um, know how to do the problems though, treat it like a test. Please don't use notes, please don't Google stuff. Just show me what you know. You know, you'll, you'll have chances to retake it. So, uh, so just go ahead and be real honest with it. So anyways, this will show up. Uh, you'll click on it. The first thing that you see will not be what you see. Uh, it'll be something like, it'll look a little bit like this. This is teacher view instead of yours. But once you click on it to start, it, it's in forms. Um, it'll pop up inside of Teams and it'll show this form right here. And then, and then you go to, you just take it in here. And notice the first question is which color works for you today? So um, I'm just gonna switch screens real quick. You would take it here, but I just have a little a dummy version of it. So it looks something like this. You're taking it, which color works for you today? I don't know, I, I feel like it's a red day. Uh, this is a required question, you need to answer it. And so here's what'll happen is you'll get some question asked. So like number two, there'll be some math question here. And you do your work on it. Now what I want you to do is do some scratch work because you're gonna enter your answer and then the next question, the whole quiz is like this. The next question is, show your work for number two, upload a picture of it here. And notice it says upload file here. So a couple options you can do. Uh, one of them is uh, just take a picture of your work. You save the, uh, save the file and upload it. Now I know that many of you know how to do that. Um, I am going to require you to do this for each question in order to get credit for it. Um, I just want to show you a couple ways to do it from, from here on out through the rest of the video. So if you're feeling good from now, you don't need to watch the rest of the video. But also, once you're, once you're done with it, you've already chosen your, your color and all that. I'm back in Teams now. What I want to do is just make sure that you um, submit it at the end after you've gone through all the problems, submit at the end, and then um, back in Teams, make sure that you turn it in as well. Do, bo do both things for me, please. Thank you. But here's a couple of ideas if you're not sure how you can upload work. Uh, one of them is do it on paper and then just take a picture with your, with your camera. So if I look uh, down here and start, I'm just gonna type camera. Oh, there it is, my camera app. And that pops right up. Hey, how you doing there? Oh man, I need to shave. All right, and then you could just hold up your work and just take a picture. And then the question becomes like, where did you save it, right? So in camera, if you look down here, uh, you can click on that and that'll show you where it's at. Um, this is gonna be, if you do it this way, this is gonna be in your photos. So if you uh, just start to look a bit, oh, I already have it open. So pictures, camera roll. So where this might default to somewhere else. Uh, you go to pictures and then look in camera roll. And there it is, question number two right there. So now I, I know where it's at. So I've answered my question. I think the answer is I. Um, number two, show your work for number two, upload the file. So I'm gonna upload file and it defaulted to that, but if it didn't default where I saved it from, you might want to just save it to your desktop too. And you can navigate over here to get to it. Just click the file, hit open, and it's gonna upload it for you. Now, if you have trouble with this, do, do email me, save all your pictures. Just go ahead and finish the quiz and save all your pictures. Another option uh, for you, here's another question. This would be a math question, blah, 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 number four. Um, and the question isn't coming up. I just blanked out the questions. And notice that it shows uh, show uh, upload your work for number three. It should say number four. I'll fix that. Uh, upload a picture here. So let me. Uh, my, I think my answer is gonna be um, x x. <laughs> uh, 
uh, x is less than or equal to 2. There's, there's my answer. And so upload the file. So another option for your work is if you don't want to do the paper, if you're doing it on your computer, um, you can use whatever you like. I like Windows Ink Workspace a lot. So if I click on this, notice I clicked on Sketchpad. Let me do that again. Sketchpad. Um, and sometimes there'll be a picture here already. You can just delete it. You know, if there's something here already, you just trash it. So you can do your work here. Choose your pen color, you know, how, how big you want, how thick you want your line to be. But anyways, you could just do your work here, you know. The blah, blah, blah. Oh, and I got some sort of answer. Now here's what I love about this. Uh, you can just take it, save the whole thing. Or if you want, you can just crop your work. So what do I actually want saved? There's my work right there. I hit check. And then I can say, uh, I could say copy it, or this is even better. Why don't I just save it? Save it as, and I'll call this, uh, and notice I'm just saving this to my desktop. You can save it, keep track of where you save it to. I'll call this uh, question two or question four. Okay, I saved that to my desktop. I'm gonna get out of here now. So now when I go to upload that work, upload file, I know I saved that on my desktop and I knew that it, I called it uh, question four, open, and it's saving it. So if uh, that doesn't have any sense, you have any questions about that, message me, let me know, and uh, good luck on this assessment. Remember, do your best. Be honest on it. You can always do a retake. Not that big of a deal. Hey, I hope you're doing. I hope you're doing good too. I miss seeing y'all.